Thank you, Margie. Whether you've always wanted to learn or you're pretty good at painting, you're invited to join friends and neighbors for a fun paint and sip event that is happening. Dr. Monique Williams joins us along with Vicki Hopkins and the artist who will remain anonymous because he's doing great work. Good morning. How's everybody doing? Great. Right. Very well, thank you. Very good. So, Dr. Williams, we have an interesting event coming up that has mocktails and gives people a chance to paint. Where is this happening and how can we get involved? So, this is happening at Oak Street Health at our Tower Grove location. And on the 19th of April, we will be um, doing a paint and sip event with mocktails and an opportunity for everyone to explore their creative side. How does this give people a chance to explore your creative side? Because you might take a step back and say, I'm not doing as good as I thought I was going to do, but you're still creating a creative space in your mind. Yeah, and actually participating in art is really relevant for um, mm -hmm. well-being for yes. anyone across the lifespan from kids to older adults. And for older adults, it can be a great way to get out mm -hmm. and get some social engagement and uh, you know, explore your creativity, which has been an area of enthusiasm for a lot of people since the pandemic started. Great point. So, right um, you know, people have started dabbling with different creative activities, and this gives an opportunity to look at expression in art. And studies have actually demonstrated that doing creative um, activities like visual arts can actually benefit brain health. Now, so, memory and thinking. Very good. Thank you for sharing that with us, Dr. Williams. Vicki, real quick, did this start, this event start before the pandemic, or did you guys come up with this after the pandemic? Uh, we started this after the pandemic uh, with Oak Street. And what made you guys decide to start this event? Uh, they were just looking at ways that they could uh, reach their mm -hmm. uh, customers and uh, reached out to me, and uh, we partnered up, and uh, we're having a lot of fun with it. How's the response been so far from the people who participated? Uh, they've loved it. Uh, we have uh, added a second class uh, for the next couple of months to be able to accommodate people and uh, are expecting uh, people to uh, continue uh, to grow and uh, support this. Sounds like it's going to be a great event. When and how can people get involved? So the event is on April 19th, okay. and people can register online. Mm -hmm. Just go to oakstreethealth.com forward slash events, mm -hmm. and then narrow it down to a 50-mile radius, and you'll find our event on the 19th of April. What types of ages and talent level are you guys welcoming? There are no stipulations on talent level. <laughs> okay. And for age, we're looking at older adults, but anyone is welcome. But um, Oak Street Health focuses on well-being and health and preventative care for adults who are Medicare beneficiaries, so the majority are older adults. When you see people putting this resource to use that you provided for them to have an outlet being creative and have some mocktails, how does that make you feel as a helper? It's very inspiring. As a, as a physician, one of the things that you really worry about is the global health of your patients. Mm -hmm. So being able to do an intervention that improves well-being, that helps to facilitate socialization and consequently can have benefits, you know, long term if people keep with it for mm -hmm. memory and thinking is really impactful and just seeing the enthusiasm and the joy in people's awesome. faces when they create their final product. And I think a lot of people got more creative during the pandemic and wanted to branch back out to maybe some of the things they enjoyed doing when they were younger. Definitely, definitely. That's something that a lot of people said it, the pandemic did allow the downtime to think about their creative side and something they hadn't thought about in years. So it really is very transformative for people. Dr. Williams, thank you very much for joining us. We're going to have this full interview on our website, foxynow.com. Vicki, thank you for joining thank us. You. Nat, can we give them a quick shot real quick as we go to break of this fine piece of art? Not bad, not bad. You guys can do this all at Oak Street Health. Find the full details on foxynow.com. We're back with more coverage you can count on.